Oh my God, Supreme, that took so long. How's it going guys? It's your host with the most Solaris 100 and I'd like to talk a little bit about the first delivery from Supreme uh, in the new year. I finally got this package through the post today and let me tell you, it was quite a journey. It took a long time for Supreme to ship my items. Uh, it was the first drop of the year so everybody was like frantically buying and uh, I, can, I can see how that takes a while to ship it to me. But uh, after that, UPS delivered it to my door. Suddenly I got a notification, sorry we couldn't deliver you items because you were not at home, which was not true. UPS, you're bullshitting. So yeah, then I thought like, okay, you know, I'm not gonna take that risk again. And I booked it to a UPS access point. The next day I got another notification that, yeah, sorry, we, we still couldn't deliver your item because it was rejected. I was like, what the fuck? Why are they rejecting a UPS parcel? Well, they told me that they were basically pausing their UPS services for like two weeks. And I was like, dude, but three times is the charm. So uh, I booked it to yet another UPS access point and that luckily was open. So yeah, here we are. I finally got my deliveries from the week one Supreme drop. So we wasted enough time to wait for this thing. Let's open it up and see what I got. Maybe you checked out my video about uh, the Supreme Spring Summer Collection. I was discussing there which pieces I really like and what I was looking to get. Actually on that day, I tried to get my excitement in check. So there were a couple of items in my cart which I then kind of checked out again because uh, yeah, the, the bill just went too high. So I really tried to concentrate on the key pieces I wanted to have. Anyway, I did get a couple of pieces, so let's check them out. So yeah, let's... Uh, get the boring stuff out of the way. First thing that greets me is, of course, the Supreme shopping bag. They are always adding one of these heavy duty thick Supreme shopping bags into, into the packages. So you have that feeling that you actually went to the store and you got your bag. The bags are a bit of a collectible item as well because they're really heavy quality and they got the box logo on it. Ooh. Okay, I was really lucky because not only did I get the free gift this time, I got a selection of stickers as well and not just the box logo. Uh, of course, if there's any Supreme related flower, it must be the poppy seed because of the Supreme Red. It comes with the Supreme logo. Um, it has some kind of planting instructions on the back. Moving on, as you can see, I got uh, three different stickers in the box, which is quite cool because normally whenever I ordered, I only would get one box logo sticker. Let's see what I got. Oh. Oh no, the resale value is already going down. So of course we got the basic box logo. We got these uh, four Molotov stickers and uh, we got the Supreme necklace sticker. Now the first proper item I got were these gardening gloves. To me, this is a classic fun Supreme accessory. Uh, it's very cheap. It's ridiculous. And uh, yeah, it somehow still works very well with the Supreme branding. What's up my gardening homies? Uh, works great with the Supreme on the knuckles, yo, yo, yo. And it's just one of these classic, ridiculous Supreme items where people go like, why the fuck did you even get that? That's crazy. I love Supreme for doing this kind of shit. Next up, let's get the flex and hype beast thing going on a little bit. Everybody goes crazy for the box logo. Personally, I feel if you're overdoing it, you look ridiculous. But to be honest with you, having a couple of box logo hats, I think it's still acceptable, you know? As you know from my Supreme preview video, I was really keen to get that one because I just love the color. I really love the mesh structure of the cap. It just gives it a very unique look. Uh, on the back, you have uh, World Famous 2018. On the right side, you have this flaming baseball embroidered on the hat. Personally, I don't really care so much about that embroidery because I'm not really into baseball. But then again, it looks quite classic and clean. So yeah, flame on, man, flame on. Now let's get to the main event, the main item I copped. Oh, and here we go. Actually, this is much bigger than I expected. The 2018 10 Supreme Duffel. Uh, this is actually looking way bigger than uh, I expected because on the website they had like two sizes. One is a big travel size, one is a more casual day bag size. I went for the smaller size bag, but uh, to be honest with you, that looks actually pretty big to me. Let's get that out of the way. 
I was really tempted to go for the red bag because Supreme Red is always a little bit more iconic and hype. But to be honest with you, I'm really digging the sand color and I'm really digging the black straps with the white Supreme on it. You know what? Let's get some other Supreme bags for comparison. One second. Okay, so when I compare this bag to the size of this big travel bag I got last year at Supreme, I must say they're about the same size, which is a bit surprising because I expected this one to be more the size of a small duffel so you can like easily rock it when you're going somewhere. But yeah, this is more like a full-fledged travel bag because, uh, you know, I used to travel a lot with that bag, which you should know if you're following me on Instagram and Twitter. So yeah, well, uh, a lot of baggage here. Let me know in the comments if you ordered this bag as well. In the bigger size, let me know the measurements of that one because I would be really intrigued uh, if this is really uh, the smallest version of this bag. If you don't want to carry it around like this, the bag comes with a shoulder strap as well, which goes without saying. So yeah, these were my pickups from the first drop of Supreme in 2018. We are already in week three, which means that the crazy Supreme Nike NBA collabo will be dropping. Let me know in the comments what you think about that collection because it gets trashed a lot on the internet at the moment. Everybody thinks it's fucking ugly. Like this video, subscribe to my channel. We already cracked 200 subscribers, which is awesome. Next stop, 500 and uh, if I'm getting 500 subscribers then maybe I should honor the tradition of YouTube to do some funky giveaway. So subscribe to my channel, spread the word, comment below, like this video and uh, yeah until next time. Whoa!